There may just be one day left for state lawmakers to approve new state laws, including any type of gun reform laws that some want to see in the wake of the deadly shooting at a Nashville Christian school. We're following Tennessee Governor Bill Lee's final push. You know, yesterday he sent out this video calling on state lawmakers to back his expanded orders of protection, a measure he says would separate people from their guns if they're found to be a danger to themselves or others. But that means convincing fellow Republicans it would not violate Second Amendment rights. And the governor said it would have strong due process protections and include penalties for anyone who files a false report. And last night we showed you the protest here in Knoxville's Market Square. Also in Nashville it was happening, other communities as well. People locking arms, wearing red, calling for action from lawmakers. But as WAT6 on your side, State Capitol News reporter Chris O'Brien is finding out those efforts may not bring any changes. This is not going to pass in the House. On what's expected to be the penultimate day of session, Governor Bill Lee's gun reform amendment appears to be dead in the water, at least for this year. This is not Congress. We actually read the bills. We go through the bills in detail. And you, you cannot responsibly pass a 15-page bill in a couple of days. This is not how our committee structure works. The amendment would introduce a temporary mental health order of protection to remove guns from someone a court finds threatening. It's maddening when a group of people whose job theoretically is to represent Tennesseans and whose job is to legislate is refusing to do either. A red flag law, an overreaction to something that happened, and that's what this is, is not something that we can take up right now because that's a 15-page bill. With the legislation coming from the governor's office, it raises the question, could we see a special session soon? I support a special session to get this done. I mean, we need it from across the state of Tennessee, from Memphis to Mountain City. You would have so many people that would call it a gun control special session. You would have both groups descend on the Capitol. It would be absolute chaos. And so I don't think a special session would be the way to go. I did reach out to the governor's office Wednesday to see if he was considering a special session if the amendment does indeed fail. The response? Governor Lee is asking the General Assembly to vote on the bill during the legislative session. As he said, we owe Tennesseans a vote. In Nashville, Chris O'Brien.